Hello there, welcome back to the Chaps Guide channel. My name is Ash and I'm your host on this journey through men's style, self-development and personal grooming. Now, over the last few months I've made a number of videos addressing people's everyday carry. I did a video on uh, dealing with overstuffed pockets and the impact that has on our clothing. And I've also done a video recently on how to choose the right wallet for your situation. And that led me to think about my own everyday carry situation. And quite some little while ago, I decided to change over to a smaller wallet. I'm constantly trying to minimize the amount of things that I carry around with me, particularly if that means carrying superfluous items that I never actually use. And when it comes to a wallet, for a long time, I've been carrying a bifold wallet, which means plenty of spaces, plenty of slots to carry cards, money, and other such things. But the reality is, we're living in an era where your everyday carry, particularly when it comes to a wallet, is becoming smaller and smaller because we don't need to carry, physically carry, our, our cards and money because, you know, let's be honest, money is becoming uh, less and less commonly used and you can carry your credit cards, uh, loyalty cards and things of that nature now on your mobile phone, in your electronic wallet. So with that in mind, I've been seeking to downsize my wallet from a bifold to a simple card holder. And I think I have found a good solution in so much as I have now got a nice card leather card carrier rather than that twice the size, at least bulky bifold wallet. Maybe if one can consider it, you can have an extravagance of having a card holder on the days where you just need to carry a small number of cards. But if you're going into the city and you need to carry some membership cards for some clubs or whatever you need to go in, then you can swap things over to that bifold wallet. But today, I'd like to talk to you about the simple leather card holder that I've struck upon as my perfect everyday carry solution. Now the leather card holder that I'm showcasing here today comes from British company Harbour of London. Now they're an e-commerce company which has been around since 2012 and their inception story is quite interesting. Um, a couple of the founder members were in London in a flat uh, and they were discussing the poor quality of leather sleeve covers for various electronic devices. That conversation led to the founding of the Harbour Leather Company, which now makes a vast variety of leather products, things like wallets, card holders, weekend bags, occasion bags, uh, backpacks, sleeve covers for things like iPads and, and telephones. But the one thing which they all have in common is high quality leather goods and if like me you appreciate leather because of its tactile nature and its longevity once it's in your collection it's something that will last for very many years and get better as time goes on you may appreciate having a look at some of the products which harbour offers now the leather card holder which i'm reviewing for you today is made of premium full grain leather and it's been manufactured in spain a place where you know I increasingly hear of when I review and trial leather products. It seems to be the epicenter for quality leather manufacture on the globe at the moment. Now Harbour are convinced that you will be satisfied and enjoy their products. So much so that they underpin your purchasing experience by a 60 day money back guarantee and a one year warranty on any of the products which you buy from them, which of course gives you some confidence in the purchasing experience. Now the solution to my everyday carry problem for me was the super slim leather card holder with RFID protection which I selected from the Harbour catalogue. And it's got many of the, the prerequisites which I was looking for when I was looking to downsize the bulky nature of my bifold wallet and replace it with something a lot more simple. Such as, for a start, it has a really slim profile. This means I can slip it into my back pocket 
and it's not going to affect the drape of my trousers in any way. In fact, you know, being so used to carrying a bifold wallet, when this is in my back pocket, it feels like I don't have my wallet and I have to keep checking to make sure I've got it with me. Um, some of the other features which I find really attractive, the fact that it's got a quick draw uh, section on the back so your most commonly used card can be kept there so it's easy to get hold of when you're you know you're popping into a store you want to buy something you don't need to go rummaging around in the main compartment in that main compartment it can hold up to I believe five or six cards or of course a combination of cards cash whatever you want to keep in there nice and snug they're not going to slip out. In fact, it takes a little bit of time to get your cards easily going in and out of there because it grips them nice and tight. However, there is a very nice a feature on this card because there is a pull-up tab which aids in getting the cards out. So quite simply, there's a little leather tab which you pull up and it, because mine is quite new, it's still quite stiff, you pull that tab up and the card pops out, ready for you to use in daily use. Then you can slip it back in and that uh, tab goes right back down again, ready to use the next time. It's a really useful feature and allows you to pop those cards out on the go, nice and easy, no need to go sticking your fingers in and rummaging around. I really like that element of it. And as I said, this has RFID protection which in essence means that if somebody, I don't know, walks up next to you when you're catching public transport, the bus or the underground, and they try to steal some of the data from your cards using a data grabber device, the RFID protection puts an obstacle between them and the theft of your data. So it's something, again, which gives you confidence in the knowledge that you could have this in your pocket with an element of protection. The other thing I liked about it is that you can personalise it. Um, it comes in a range of different colours, but I opted for this nice uh, sort of mid-brown colour, as you can see. But you can personalise it by putting your name or anything like that, and they'll add that on for you. Uh, and I just put the chap. Now, the wallet costs in its basic form, without any personalisation, 69 British pounds can be shipped anywhere in the world by harbour. Uh, and I think that's a fairly approachable point for a well-manufactured all leather card holder, which let's face it, is well-designed, stylish to look at, and is likely to be with you for many, many years. I can tell by just looking at the way this is manufactured and the quality of that premium full grain leather that this is going to be a keeper. It's something that can be with me for 10, 20, maybe more years. Uh, so you're investing in an everyday carry solution, which uh, you know will unfold with you as the years go by. And of course, with leather, which is one of the things which always attracts me to it, it gets better in appearance and in its tactile touch as the years goes by, as the leather uh, forms to the shape of your pocket, your body, uh, and gets softer and softer as time passes. So what are my observations of the actual lived experience of carrying around this little wallet with me for the last month or so? And I should tell you, uh, last week I was in Greece and this was perfect to carry around in my shorts because when you're in a very warm climate, you really don't want a big wallet weighing down your clothing. This for me was perfect for my holidays and I've been carrying it in daily use for about a month or so now, now with um, very pleasing results. The first thing I want to tell you though is that I've not been paid to talk about this wallet. This material is not sponsored, it's not paid content, I don't do that on my channel. Total integrity here. Um, the brand um, actually gave me this wallet as a sample, so I didn't pay for it, but they have no influence whatsoever on what I'm about to say, uh, and they are watching this video at exactly the same time as you are. So no influence exerted whatsoever. So my experience is, this is a well-made, well-designed and well-manufactured wallet, which is lovely and slim and has coped with all my carrying requirements since I've been using it over the last month. It feels great. It's very comfortable. It's been able to receive all of the cards which I wish to carry around with me. And the thing which I really like about it is that quick draw pocket on the back, which means I can just slip those cards out anytime I need, but at the same time, they're kept in there nice and safe and secure, which is 
my most required item or, or thought with my wallet, I want the cards to be safe as well as nice and comfortable in my pocket. And of course, my most important requirement was that the wallet be nice and slim and took over from my larger, much more bulky bifold wallet. And I have to say, it absolutely does. It has really stepped into the breach and I don't think I need to carry anything larger than this ever again. Yet, as well as being practical, when the time comes to foot the bill, say you're in a bar with friends or associates or you know new business clients, you pull out your wallet, lovely leather, looks great, appears the part, you've got the style element covered as well as the practicality. So for me, this little Harbour uh, super slim leather card holder is what's in my back pocket from this point onwards. So I hope you've enjoyed this video uh, and hear, hearing about my observations and review of this wallet. Certainly been a bit of a winner for me. If you have, give it a thumbs up. If you'd like to see more, click the red button. If you'd like to support the channel, of course, you can buy us a coffee. You'll see the show notes below on how to do that. And of course, you know, I look forward to seeing you again in my next video. Tell me what you'd like to see me reviewing or perhaps uh, a solution to a problem that you may have in your everyday carry as well. So until the next time, carry a nice wallet, but make it nice and light and it doesn't affect the drape of your clothing. Until then, take care. And I will see you again very soon.